Hey Max, you ready to catch the biggest fish of your life? Yeah. Can I get I want, a you bet? I want some enthusiasm. <laughs> you bet. You bet, bud. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I got my brother Max down here. And dad. And I got titties. And dad's holding chicken titties. Bye -bye. But yeah, brought dad, brought bro down to uh, my favorite spilling way. Yes, this is probably the last time I'll come here. But I had an idea. This week. This week. Yeah. Coming back tomorrow. There's uh, been a lot of comments on my last two videos wanting me to drop a GoPro into the water to see what's down at the uh, bottom of the glorious spilling way. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do today. But after watching a couple videos online, I had a better idea rather than just throwing my GoPro down to the bottom and hoping for the best, I guess, because it'd probably get pushed around and all that jazz. We're gonna catch one of the catfish and we're gonna strap the damn GoPro to the catfish. Yes, it's been done. There's a couple videos recently. Uh, this is kind of the fish whispers idea, I guess, so I can't say I coined it as my own. I feel like it's the most effective way to get a camera down there to see what's living there. And uh, that's exactly what we're gonna do. Goal number one, bro getting his PB out of a dirty little spilling way. Goal number two, getting the camera down there. Hopefully the water clarity is at least decent enough to be able to see something, but I imagine if we let little Timmy swim around down there long enough, we'll probably at least run into one of his buds. I think it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's gonna We're happen. gonna do it. You're the one that's gotta catch it. I've already caught about 72 of them out of here, so I don't need to catch any. I mean, the visibility is like at least a foot. Oh yeah. We'll try it. All right, here it goes. Wow. All the water in here just turned Get ready to hold on. Something's yeah. gonna try to rip it out of your hands. Yeah, something's gonna be angry out here. Jello. Look at this weird worm I caught, Max. That is a strange worm. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Casey's came through. Threw a green sunfish in there for me. Nice. Oh, I already got a Do you? Yeah, you do. <laughs> oh god. You give it a whirl. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we gotta Hold on tight. It. It's big. <laughs> that was fast. Just started. Alright, so let him run when he needs to run, okay? So he wants to go down, so try to maybe pull up a little bit. Yeah, just lift him. And then reel when you go down, I'm gonna kind of hair. Yeah, Get him, bro. Down. Max is the, wrath. the wrath of the kitty. Get him, bro. Game like nothing on it. All right, now reel down, and then you lift up. <laughs> it's so big. A father-son moment at the <laughs> at its finest. <laughs> it might be. It might be a whale. You got a whale? Pretty yeah. Put it. Away. Put it on your belly. Belly or like like that? Yeah. No, not not the ween. <laughs> He's pulling. You got to get some leverage. There you go. Go down and then lift up. Put, up, put it on your belly like that so you can lift the rod again. Down and then lift up. There you go, bro. Kick his ass. Kick his ass, see bud. <laughs> Dude, it's so big. He's so much struggle in his eyes. Lift you, up. You got down. this, Max. All by yourself. There you go. There it is. I, I think it's large. There you go. Now you're doing it. Now reel down. Drop your rod, reel down. Now lift up again. There we go. Now we're cooking with peanut oil. What do you think, bro? Is it big? Yeah, I think so. He's coming in now. Wrench him. Nope. Get it on your belly. It's gonna be the only way you get leverage. Here you go. Hard in me. Take a drag. See him. Oh, Ooh. he's pretty large, bud. Pretty big, man. All right, I'm gonna start getting the GoPro ready. Good job, bro. Oh my! <laughs> get him, bro. Look at this one, buddy. Yes. Sure. Yeah, bud. He got it down too. Yeah, he does. Good job, bro. Look at that. Get <laughs> it, bud. Max, you're gonna need a picture with this guy. No, I'm, I'm not gonna hold it. 
Absolutely you are. You don't have to put your hand in his mouth though. No, dude. We'll show you how to hold him right, okay? You want to grab his tail with your right hand. Under though. Under. Put your four fingers under. Under. Other way. Yep, flipper. Like that? There you go. Now squeeze his tail as hard as you can. Just grab the whole meat and then just put your hand under his belly. I'm trying to. Oh, okay. Hurry, stop. No, we're good, dude. You got him. Is he good? Yep. I'm just holding it until you're ready. Yeah, I'm ready. Good job, Good job, bro. As far as you can. That's big, bud. You smile or something? <laughs> Biggest fish of your life. He's a little bit longer. <laughs> you got him, dude. You got nice him. Nice fish. What do you think about that? Yeah, That's your big fish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, let me save him. We just started. All right, let's do my stupid stuff. I know it looks like torture, folks, but this is actually good for the catfish. <laughs> yes. This is the best he day of his life. He actually requested this. Dude, that is like... Perfect. Hi, bud. <clears throat> Kitty bud. Is that gonna hold? Could uh, just now just wrap it around there a bunch of times so it comes back. Yeah, good idea. Chances are you're not gonna get it back, but. <laughs> I like the faith, bro. Thanks, Max. <laughs> Thanks for the the good measure. It's at 65. Yeah. All right. There Recording. It there it is. All Set strapped up. Nice. Got the. Uh, Got 65 pound braid tied to the GoPro, so hopefully I don't lose it. But if I do, I guess I do. We're gonna send it in for research purposes. He's been out for a little while, but I had everything ready, so it didn't take very long. He's doing good. Good job to bro for catching him. Now we're gonna dump him in. Hopefully I get my camera back. Let's see how this plays out. Goodbye, GoPro. There he goes. Oh Great gosh. Oh God, no, I didn't turn it on. Oh, no. no, failure. Good call though. What an idiot. I figured there'd be uh, some trials. Yeah, I mean, turning it on. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily he's tired. Uh, that and it's gonna freaking not come off ever. Full battery and it's recording. I'm gonna tighten it up a little bit. There you go, Billy. Buddy. Good luck. Go show us what's down there. I love you. Now what? We just give him like, he's pulling line. Yeah, we just give him like two hours. We'll give him like, what, 10 minutes? Yeah, 10 minutes with his grid. <clears throat> Hopefully he sees cool stuff. <laughs> Can't believe I didn't turn it on. Good save. <laughs> what if I would have been home and it wasn't even on? <laughs> We're not Lucy smart. Go -go and it wasn't even on. <laughs> All right, old buddy's out there in the spilling way, pulling out some line. We're going to hold off on the fishing for a little bit. I don't even feel like catching a fish today, but we're going to give it 10 minutes. Let him swim around out there. Bring him back in. Hopefully when I pull on him hard enough, the GoPro just comes off the back because I don't really want to mess with him too much. But yeah, it's for scientific research purposes and stuff. So uh, hopefully we can get the camera back. And hopefully it's actually visible down there. To be determined, stay tuned. Let's see what the hell happens. What do you think he's doing down there? <laughs> the only thing I'm worried about is the current pushing the camera back because it's not tightened all the way. Or it, I don't think it's gonna wrap around him. Or there is a tree out there. Yeah. I don't want him to swim into that, but I'm thinking with the 65 pound braid. You would think he would come out of it eventually though too. Worst case scenario, if it gets snagged, I'll, I'll swim in there. There you go. I ain't scared. Yeah, I mean, he's probably been in for a decent amount of time. Is he 
he snagged? He ain't snagged. He's not snagged. Nope, nope, he's not snagged. He's still on there. I was hoping the GoPro would just fall off, but... We had to do it good. Sorry, bud. It's for research. <laughs> the camera didn't move. <laughs> the camera is strapped. Oh, the camera's perfectly straight. You're right, man. All right, big girl, time for a real release now. We're not playing with you this time. You get to go home. Is it? Yep, it's black and red. When he turned out that it turned off and on and off. That wouldn't be funny, Max. That would not be good. All right, Josh's experiment was a success. It worked! Eight minutes. Eight minutes down you there. You should have seen something in eight minutes. Yeah. So I'll sick. I'll have to go home and review the footage, but. I like it. Hey Max, how do you think the underwater footage turned out? Oh, I don't know. It's a toss up? Maybe. Could be good, could be terrible. We are going to call it quicks. Call it quits. Old Max, he caught another catfish. Be sure to check out Dad's video. Max Great. laid the hammer down on some dirty whisker dongs. We're all leaving. Uh, we caught fish, or Max did. Dad and I didn't catch anything. Did, yeah, we, we didn't. A couple. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to go home, review the footage, come along with me. I'll watch it with you the first time. I won't, I won't spoil it. So. Reaction video. Reaction video of my own footage at home. Let's do this. Bye-bye. All right, well, I'm going to make this short and sweet because you guys didn't come to see my face and you already saw what you needed to see. Or maybe some of you did come to see my face. If you did, I appreciate you. But anyway, all in all, the footage was about a 6 or 7 out of 10. From what I expected, I'm just glad I got the GoPro back and I'm glad we saw something because in Nebraska, we aren't exactly known for clean water. That was actually some of the cleaner water that we have around here. So I'm glad we got to see at least something. It looked like there was at least five or six other catfish. One of them was smaller, but the other one seemed to be a little bit bigger swimming down there with old Timmy Bud. All in all, I'd give it a success. For the first time trying it, it wasn't too bad. And uh, I'll uh, definitely be trying it again. Comment down below if you want me to try to uh, dump a camera down in another dirty little spilling way. I got a uh, clear water one in mind that uh, might be the next destination. So I do appreciate you watching. Um, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe. Hit the bell notification thingy, dinger, majig. Like this video, leave a comment. Tell me uh, if you want to see some more. But uh, yeah, I'm going to end it on that note. Definitely appreciate you guys watching and uh, see you real soon. Okay. T-D-Y-L. Love you. Good. Bye.